There was a knock on the door. There was two police officers from Rio Rancho, New Mexico. I opened the door and they asked if my name was Gordon McRae and I said yes. They said you're under arrest to charge with uh, two indictments alleged to have occurred between 1979 and 1983. Thomas Grover claimed that at the age of 12, I raped him in St. Bernard's Rectory in Keene, New Hampshire. I arrived at St. Bernard's Rectory in Keene, New Hampshire on June 15, 1983, two weeks before David Grover's 18th birthday. So I could not have been there when he was 12 years old. When he was asked to explain why he came back from week to week after being raped, he said, I don't know how I got there, I repressed it. He said I had out-of-body experience. The detective in New Hampshire who choreographed this case personally faxed 40 pages to a New Mexico newspaper. They came back in less than two hours with a guilty verdict on all counts. Judge Brennan sentenced me to 30 times the state's proffered plea deal. If you really want a view of the Catholic sex abuse scandal, this is the place to go for it. Because these guys see right through it. I floated something one day to some prisoners who were talking to me. I said, in my estimation, about a third of these claims are false. And they all said, no, I don't agree. It's at least half, maybe more. This is a scam. They wonder when the church is going to wake up. Anyone can just pick up the phone and say, this priest touched me and he handed $50,000.